A team that began its time in Formula One in controversial circumstances, the 24-year-old spell in the championship came to an end in 2002 in the midst of growing financial problems. Even so, the team with the most of the world championship begins to his credit, in 382, without having a victory, Arrows was close to worrying the upper pass of the podium along its curious history, but each one fell short time. The British team, initiated by former Lotus F1 pilot, Jackie Oliver, Alan Rees and Franco Ambrosio, went through multiple changes in their last years. He spent six seasons as foot game in the 1990s, before Tom Walkinshaw took over 1997 and restored the name of the Arrows. Although the team had an encouraging start under his mandate, with Scott's investment helping to bring the 1996 champion Damon Hill and the famous designer John Barnard the team, he possibly exaggerated his abilities with an internal motor project. The future looked briefly bright when claiming a title sponsorship agreement with the orange telecommunications giant before the new millennium, but Arrows and Tom Walkinshaw Racing began to hit the money problems and, therefore, closed their doors in the mid-2002 season. Two decades later, it is time to classify team pilots. Unlike many of our previous lists, there is no victory count to help, and therefore a difficult task was to find a definitive top 10. 10. Christian Fittipaldi Fittipaldi caused a good impression during his simple season with the team, in 1994, reaching its maximum point with the fourth photo in Aida by Motorsport Images. Arrows slash footwork year, 1994. Arrows slash foot game begin, 16. Points with the team, 6. The nephew of the two-time Emerson champion, Christian Fittipaldi, was underestimated during his time in F1 and caught Footwork's attention after his heroic with mine. Fittipaldi established an immediate impression by joining the foot game in 1994, taking full advantage of a decent FA15 written by Alan Jenkins with a relatively adjusted budget. Although Johnny Morbidelli surpassed it at the opening of the Interlagos season, Fittipaldi 11 degrees to La Sexta de Morbidelli, the Brazilian reversed the damage when claiming ninth on the network next time, and then charged an excellent room in the Great Pacific Award in Aida. The feat works aligned 6th and 7th in Monaco, Fittipaldi once again before Morbidelli, but the gearbox of the first one was packed while he ran in 5th place, with a very real possibility that a podium was removed. Sixth in the Canadian GP for Fittipaldi was then Chow, 